Hi friends, welcome back to the Guitar Spa where we bring you all the beautiful guitars uh, review just for you. And um, I have another Maestro guitar from Singapore that is just handcrafted and, and purely designed uh, in Singapore. And this is actually a, a Singapore uh, startup company uh, that, that produces uh, guitars uh, made in, in, in Singapore. And uh, we have the Maestro, uh, what you call that, Victoria, M-E. M-E stands for Makasa Ebony. And this basically is like a, a triple O size with a Florentine cutaway. Um, and let's get this review started. Basically, this is a, like an OM size, triple O size um, guitar with the um, Florentine cutaway. Very much, um, I would say, the design looks like very much like the Irwin Simoji guitars. And uh, this one is a specially made uh, guitar custom with an Enderon deck screw stop on this uh, guitar. You have also the uh, Makasa Ebony Wood Rosette with the Perfling Lines, red thick Perfling Lines is beautiful. Per red Perfling Lines on top of this, uh, what we call that, um, top Perfling up on, on the top. And the back insects are Makasa Ebony, which is actually an Ebony species. Beautiful Makasa Ebony. Um, this reminds me, it looks like Maka, it, it, it is Makasa Ebony, but I, you know, personally feel it looks more like a Malaysian Blackwood uh, that is Malaysia, found, found in Malaysia. And this one has a beautiful set. It's a little bit dark here. You can't really see from your, your what you call that, camera, I mean, the, on the video, but uh, there's dark streaks, black spider webbings here, and a little bit of that brownish uh, hue that goes, it's like, uh, mixed together black ink and it's a really solid wood um, the the whole guitar is bound with uh, I would say also ebony also wood binding but with, with the red purfling lines and, and it really gives you that the beautiful uh, looking of guitar even the fretboard has the red purfling lines uh, and even the headstock Makasa ebony headstock head plate and the uh, also the Indian rosewood uh, what you call that uh, laminate that is back on the back plate. Guitar 118, uh, no, Groover tuners with uh, the Ebony, um, call it tuner packs. Um, the, the whole guitar, it has, the, the guitar has the Ebony bridge, Ebony fretboard. But one thing interesting, uh, they came with a certificate that is, look here, certificate, let me just read. Uh, the, it actually is a 2011 model, uh, serial number 4744. Um, top Enderon deck spruce top solid Makasa ebony. The neck is basically Kayar mahogany with a carbon fiber rods. They actually fitted two carbon fiber rods that is in the neck. Uh, what that does is basically gives you a very rigid, very, very stiff neck. And that will eliminate all the wolf notes ac across the, 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 the whole fretboard, especially when you're playing above the fifth fret. Fifth fret. Secondly is, the, um, with a stiffer neck, you get a little bit more sustain. The notes are, will, the timber of the notes is evenly across the fretboard. That's, that's the, the other advantage. And also, the neck is straight, you know, uh, it prevents any warpage in, in, if there, there is. When I saw the neck, it was really dead straight. So that's actually a, a plus point. Um, the other thing about the, the whole guitar is, is they call it the Maestro uh, Ultra Brace System where it has the SRS. Uh, what what it, it does is in the back back uh, back braces you have, it's like a sandwich, you have a spruce, I think a rosewood and a spruce all together to give you the best of both. You get the flexibility as well, the stiffness on 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 the the braces on the backs as well as the X brace, um, that lends and in 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 that that actually is the idea of the Macpherson guitars. I think uh, this this was the idea the way they they they, they borrowed it from there, and I think it's a good concept. Um, what Macpherson says that it says it gives you a little more clarity in terms of the the tone. I don't know whether is is it true or not, but most important is as long as the guitar sounds good, I don't really care. You can put, you can put, uh, you know, a piece of ham in the middle, and if you can just sandwich it and put it in, if as long as it sounds good, why not? Okay, so and uh, the bindings are all what what they say five wooden, you know, le uh, uh, with blood wood. Actually, it's blood wood on this baby. So you have also the sound port that is uh, 
built in on this guitar so basically you can actually it's like a subwoofer you can actually listen to a little bit more of that bottom end on this guitar this guitar has the anthem pickup that is really fit that you know you got the mic and the under saddle beautiful uh the original saddle and nut is the bleach bone nut and saddle i've upgraded the saddle to the fm to get a little bit more uh richer overtones something to know about about the makasa ebony is you have a lot of bass treble and the mids are scoop so basically and also not as much reverb time of tone that you, you reflective tau tone that you get from the indian rosewood you only get this this ebony gives you a lot of that bass tr treble but the, the, the mids are scoop so the fmi will give a little bit more that mids and a little bit more clarity um, and and the andron that gives you a little bit of that punch where you can really drive this baby a little bit more so enough of that talking let's uh listen to how this sounds i try to play as as best as i can okay Excellent, excellent fat tone. Let's come closer. Come closer and I'll play a little bit more. Play a little bit more and a little bit more and a little bit more. And, you know, just close a little bit more. Okay, tit fret. Incidentally, a lot of people ask me what do am I playing on the tit fret? These are all my own composition. I try to play whatever I feel that is in my heart and this these are all melodies that I I can hear it in my heart and my mind and then I'll just put it into into on the frets, okay? So and don't ask for taps because I don't read taps. I can't read taps, okay? So I don't even know how to write taps. So 
Just enjoy. and play my own composition.
sustain on this guitar. So there you have it, the Maestro guitar, uh, made in Singapore from the Maestro straw stores in Singapore. I think there's one in Esplanade and there's one below Excelsior Hotel. Um, you can find them. They are beautiful guitars. They are also okay, are custom guitars that are made available or beautiful ones that are crafted by the brainchild who's then the owner. And uh, this one particularly has the Android X Plus top back in Sykes uh, Makasa Avenue, but looks like lovely Malaysian blackwood with uh, a bloodwood binding, perfing lines, and really beautiful. And um, this one is equipped with the uh, the what you call that the Aerobax uh, Anthem pickup, and also a, a lovely sound port. Um, there's no f no no inlay on this guitar, and lovely uh, Groover tuners one eighteen with the ebony. Uh, what I call that the uh, buttons um, and lovely guitar. So if you like this review, what you can do for me is to just comment just below. Whatever comments, good, bad, ugly, whatever, just be com just comment. Let's let's start a conversation. And and if you want to watch more great guitar reviews, is to just press the subscribe button just below because uh, you'll be surprised because there will always be great guitars coming up coming up on this channel really good guitars and this is a, a good company if you want something that is affordable the mystery guitars are something that you should consider and um, if you want to contact me my email address is guitar saddle g-u-i-t-a-r-s-a-d-d-l-e at hotmail.com and my name is Jarvis till my next review I'm going to say live with passion play your guitar love, love joy peace health wealth grace to be multiplied in your life. I'll see you very soon. All the best. Bye-bye.